What's up, guys? This is KCB here, and today I got a review of 94 overall DeAndre Baker. This is going to be his rookie premiere card. Now, of course, guys, before we get there, do drop a like on the video because it does help the channel a lot. And if you are new, if you guys like coin making methods, if you're looking for player reviews, or if you just want general overall mug content review, um, of course, subscribe to the channel and turn that notification bell on just so you're notified anytime we drop anything or go live. Now, this card is coming in with 90 speed, guys. 91 Excel, 88 agility, 84 jumping, 93 play rec, 94 man coverage, 87 zone coverage, and 97 press. Um, one thing I really want to stress about this card, if this rookie premiere could go into a power up set, it'd be A1. I do want to stress the biggest problems that I had with this car was the speed. However, there's something I really found interesting about this car. If you look down and look at his block shedding, he has 57 block shedding. Compared to a lot of the top corners in the game, it's extremely high. So this is going to be a run stopping cornerback, which is actually extremely helpful if you ask me. Um, right now, as we know, the meta is the run game. So rarely are you going to run into a guy who's passing the ball a lot, but I will say this, DeAndre Baker isn't going to go ahead and cover a lot of space the way you would want him to. Um, he isn't going to be a cover corner, he's going to be a run stopping corner first. So what's obviously good about him is he's going to stop the run, he's going to block shut instantly, he's going to break on the ball when he does see that, you, that your opponent is running the ball. However, when it comes to coverage, he just doesn't have the speed or the height to match up very well with a lot of these big guys. Um, and on out routes especially, uh, that's one thing I noticed, especially out routes, he just gets cooked. He just gets cooked every single time. Um, does not matter what side, doesn't matter if it's a wide receiver. This game, I had Gronk cooking me every time. But look at that. When it came to blocking the run or short flat out routes and he was somewhere in space, he'd break on the ball instantly and he'd make the play and or the tackle. Here you go again, making a tackle. However, he was a little bit too slow. So because of that, Gronk was able to hold on to the ball. Boom, here you go again. He dropped it that time. Um, he had a little help by Tillman from there as well too. But like I said, he is going to get torched for the most part on these out routes, as you can see there again. Um, he just doesn't have that, like, I guess, awareness that allows him to get to the ball in, or, or, or get towards the ball when the ball's thrown. Um, there's certain cards like if you know Dion, if you have Dion, if you played against Dion Sanders, you know that anytime the ball's thrown within a five to ten yard radius around him, he breaks for the ball when it's in the air. Um, and and, and it's especially, that's especially true on out routes and on like post routes and corner routes. Um, this DeAndre Baker card is not going to do that for you, he just isn't. You are going to notice that if he's in coverage, he will miss a couple of uh major plays for you and i think that has to do with the speed and awareness but like i said when it comes down to his run stopping ability look at this boom the guy did that was uh, eric dickerson so he did get like a bounce off but he stopped him completely from getting out on uh, on the outside zone play on um, the stretch run you know so yeah it's a, he's, he's actually a really good card um yeah I, I don't recommend i do not recommend putting any abilities on him because he does have abilities available However, you only get tier one with the rookie premier version of them, so do not put any abilities on this one. Um, it'd be completely a waste of your time. But if you are interested, he does get like man up, he does get like tip drill, things of, things of that nature. He does not get enforcer, so that's one of the biggest things you have to understand about him. Now, like I said, he is going to be really good when it comes to these, um, these run stopping plays, but when it comes to passing, He's not always going to be there. There, he was behind the guy by like two yards, made the play. But like I said, he generally isn't going to be the best cover cornerback that you're going to have in this game. And as you can see there, that's why I say that. Um, it's just something about him. It's his speed, his awareness. But for a free card, for a free rookie premier card that you had nothing to do for, this card's great. I would definitely play him as your third cornerback if you need one. That's definitely where I'm going to play him for right now. Probably only until tomorrow when that Stefan Gilmore card comes out. As soon as that comes out um, with the playoff promo, I'm definitely going to get that. Get some gameplay in for you guys. Get a review in for you guys. But this DeAndre Baker, um, I give him a strong B+. B+, 
especially because of his run stopping ability. Covering, he's not the best cover corner, but if you have him playing the three, if you have him playing as your third cornerback, um, I don't see a problem because he's not going to be covering anything too deep. So he'll be good on flat routes. He'll be really good on flat routes. When you're playing like a nickel uh, 335 or if you're playing like a 245, um, if you're playing a big dime package, you can definitely put him on the inside as like an outside linebacker um, cornerback, you know. And what he's doing is he's going to play that run extremely well. So um, check him out, guys. Try him out. Like I said, put him at your uh, quarterback three. B plus overall, and that's where we're at. Yeah, this is KC Beast. I am checking in and I am checking out. I appreciate you guys for checking up. Do subscribe to the channel and of course, drop a like, like I said before, guys. I appreciate you and uh, have a good night. I'll see you later.